Let's make one more tutorial in Autodesk Fusion. In this video, you'll learn how to use the x thread and mirror. So open the Fusion and let's go. The first step to create this part, we will select the front plane and make this sketch here. And here we'll make this square 50 by 50 millimeters, okay? And we needed to extrude this square here 10 millimeters, okay? So let's create this. It is this rectangle here, okay? So open the fusion, go to create a sketch and select the front plane and select a two point rectangle, center rectangle, click here in the midpoint. 50 by 50 millimeters, press OK, finish the sketch, and go to extrude. The direction, symmetric, measurement, holy length, and the distance, 10 millimeters. Operation new body, press OK. We made this. Now we will select this face here to make a sketch here. And the sketch will be this one. Okay. And the first thing that we make here, we use the project to take reference here and we'll make these two circles with 28 millimeters and the other with 20 millimeters of geometer and then we'll create this this arc here this arc is concentric with the circle and the radius is 25 millimeters okay and it is vertical here so let's create this go to create a sketch select this face here Go to create, project included, project, the selection filter, select body, select this body here, press OK. Now select a circle, make a circle here with 28 millimeters, another one with 20 millimeters, and go to create, select the arc, center point arc, click an arc here with 25 millimeters of radius. Let me move the dimensions here a little bit. And go to constraints, select horizontal vertical, select this point and this point here, this point and this point. The distance between the center of the circle and this face here is 32 millimeters. So here it is 32 millimeters here. And go to constraints, select horizontal vertical, select this point and this point here. Okay, we made this. Now we'll create this line here with seven millimeters and another line here with seven millimeters and create another line here and make the same in the other side. Or you can use the mirror, okay? Make a construction line and use a mirror. So select line, click at this point, seven millimeters here. And click here again, seven millimeters and close the sketch here, okay? You can use a mirror to make the other side, okay? Make a line between these two points here. Go to mirror, select this line, this one and this one. The mirror line, select this construction line and press OK. We have this, okay? And finish the sketch. We needed to extrude this. And the first extrusion that we'll make, we'll extrude this 10 millimeters to this side here, okay? So go to extrude, select this profile, select this area here and make an extrusion here, 10 millimeters to this side, minus 10 millimeters, operation join and press OK. We made this. Now show the sketch two again. We needed to extrude the circle here. The distance is five millimeters, okay, to make this extrusion here. So go to extrude, select this profile, five millimeters here, operation join and press OK. I you hide the sketch too. We made this, OK. Now to make this in the other side, we'll go to create and select mirror. And the object, select the features and the object type, select this extrusion here and this one, and the mirror plane, select the right plane, and press OK. We made this, OK. 
now we will select this face here the top face to make this sketch okay we need to create this sketch here here we have two lines here the distance between this circle and this edge is 28 millimeters so we'll make a circle with 18 millimeters of diameter and another one with 25 millimeters of diameter okay so go to create a sketch select this face select the circle i will rotate this a little bit make a circle here with 18 millimeters of diameter and another circle with 25 millimeters of diameter and go to create project include project select the body select this body here press ok go to sketch dimension the distance between this circle and this edge here is 28 millimeters and go to constraint select the horizontal vertical select this point and the midpoint here now select the line click at this point and make a tangent line here and click at this point make a tangent line here okay we made this now finish the sketch we need to extrude this area here this area 12 millimeters okay and we needed to extrude this pipe here the pipe the two circles here 20 millimeters okay so go to extrude select this profile minus 12 millimeters operation join press ok show the sketch 3 again go to extrude select this profile don't select the center of the circle ok minus 20 millimeters operation join press ok hide the sketch 3 we made this ok now we need to make the same but in the other side so we'll go to create and select mirror and the object type features and the object select these two extrude and the mirror plane select the top plane and press ok we made this now we've add some color here press letter a in the keyboard and select the colors and here we finish our exercise so thanks for watching Subscribe my channel for more and see you in the next videos. Bye bye.